My name is Anita Wilson. I'm the principal at Caldwell High School in Caldwell, Idaho. I've worked at Caldwell High for 13 years and this is my fifth year as principal at Caldwell High. Uh, we're very excited about our collaboration with um, the Game of Work and with our Career Technical Education program. We uh, have offered a Career Technical Education internship before, but we've never been able to partner with real life people who are out there in the field uh, to bring an experience into the classroom that really uh, brings real life experiences and on the job experiences into the classroom. Different than a teacher who is uh, maybe been in the classroom for a while, but this really brings in a nice collaborative piece that uh, our teacher is able to work in the real life examples and have a nice collaboration. So the students, as they get ready to go out into the workforce, already have real life examples and real life relevant uh, experience before they go out. I would absolutely do this again for our students. We began it this year as a trial for first semester and it's been extremely successful. Our students are really happy with the coursework and with the experience that they're getting and so we will be continuing this into second semester and then I hope that we will be able to continue it into next school year. I would recommend this program for other school districts. Uh, the people who are involved with it have been extremely easy to work with. They've asked us what do we need as a high school, what do we need to bring a real life experience to our students, and then we've been able to collaborate very closely on those um, issues that we have, logistics around our school and timeframes and teacher requirements and, and also what is our career technical requirements. And we've been able to collaborate very well, very easily work through those. And I feel seamlessly be able to fit this into our high school curriculum and, and just get a really great experience for our students. At Caldwell High School, we have unbelievable relationships with our community in lots of different ways. We partner with um, entities such as West Valley Medical Center, the YMCA, the City of Caldwell, the College of Idaho, and through this game of work, when students go out into the community, into their internship sites, our community members have really welcomed them in. And so that's exciting. They have a lot of confidence in the education that our students are getting at Cobble High School. And so it's very easy to maintain those relationships. I know our students are going to be very ready for their internship experiences. And I know that our community, uh, community entities where they're placed and businesses are gonna be very happy with their work. And I know that we'll be able to continue those partnerships also into the future. My name is Carly Manhart and this is my second year teaching at Caldwell High School and I currently teach business computer applications, graphic design, and a career and technical education internship or the game of work. I've seen these students, they, they started out the class like this. When they'd read something, they'd read it just like this and, and then they'd find a word that they couldn't pronounce and they'd stumble over it and then they'd pause and then, and then they get embarrassed and now they can read something off a piece of paper, they can project their voice, they don't get embarrassed anymore. I mean, every once in a while there's a little bit of embarrassment, but for the most part, they're, they're, they've transformed from so shy, stumbling over their words, and not wanting to project to an audience, and now they're, they're, it, it's like black and white, two completely different things, and it's, it's been awesome to see them transform. I, I, I wish all of my classes were like them. <laughs> Not to say my other classes aren't good, but they're just, I just love seeing the amount of motivation that these kids have. It's, it's inspirational for me. Being able to be that teacher that steps in there and, and knows that I'm making a difference in these kids' lives, that, I mean, that right there is enough for me. So the DISC assessment, uh, the assessment that they, the first one that they've taken, um, tells them a lot about their personalities. And from what we've, what we've learned about each other's personalities, we can now, we can look at another individual in the classroom and we can find out by their DISC assessment who they are, how they work, and we can adjust our own, even myself, 
I can adjust how I work with the students based on what I know about them from this personality test. They can adjust what they know about each other to make their workflow make sense. It's very valuable. I wish everybody in the world could take the DISC assessment so everybody knew what each person's personality was. I wish every teacher in my school would take the DISC assessment so I know how to work with them and they know how to work with me and we know how to collaborate with each other based on our different personalities and what, what motivates us and what, what drives us because that's, I mean, some people care more about tasks and getting things done strategically. Other people care more about people and being involved with relationships and, you know, comforting others and, and it's it just is really interesting because we all interact differently and I think just from the DISC assessment those the kids have learned how to interact with each other and that that's very valuable also we I mean all they did was take a test and we know so much about them from it and and watching the two groups it was so it was it just completely verified everything that we learned from the test. It, it showed, you know, if you are a D, then you're gonna step in and you're gonna dominate. You're gonna dominate the group, you're gonna lead them. And then to watch the group without the D just struggle to find a leader, and then one girl eventually stepped in, who was an I, um, that, that just goes to show how much we learned about them from, from that assessment that they took. The knowledge that has been introduced to me through SPA Academy is beyond anything I ever would have imagined. I brag all the time about how much knowledge that, it, it's stuff I, I, know, I don't even know. I mean, I'm young, but these, this, the stuff that we're teaching these kids is, I mean, nobody else thinks to teach these things. No one else would think, hey, we need to, we need to teach, the, we need to spend an entire week teaching kids how to use their voice and how to use their body language. No one else would do that. No one else would think about that. No one would think that that was important. Spot Academy has a curriculum that is rigorous and it, it makes kids, it forces kids to be successful. They're going to be. I, I have no doubt in my mind that every single student in this class is going to walk out of here being a successful individual, having the skills that they need to do exactly what they want to do with their future. SPOT Academy has brought in so much, so much extra that has been extremely beneficial for these kids. And these kids get to learn, they get, they get to learn. They know that they, they come to this class and they don't have to learn. They come here and they, they get to learn. And I, I think they know that. And I mean, for me, I don't even, who, I don't think anyone needs to be convinced. That's enough to see those kids come in here and, and, and want to learn is, I mean, for me, that, that's all I need. <laughs>